Okay, so we're asked to find the single transformation that goes from A to B. Now, looking at this, I go through my four transformations and figure, think to myself, has it just been moved? Well, no, it's been rotated, so it's not a translation. It's not changed size, so it's not an enlargement. It's not really been reflected. No, it hasn't. So it's definitely a rotation. So what I do is get my tracing paper out and draw shape A onto the tracing paper. And I basically just try a few different points. Now, I think it's going to be over here somewhere, so I try that point, and that doesn't work. Try that point, try that point, and then when you try this point here, it lines up perfectly. So that's not quite finished yet, because we've got to figure out um, where what direction it is. So I would say rotation. Okay. We know the center uh, of rotation is going to be at minus two, two. But we need the direction. So I move the tracing paper this way, which is clockwise. And it was a quarter turn, which is 90 degrees. So you look out for clockwise 90 degrees, anti-clockwise 90 degrees, or just 180 degrees. And you don't need the direction for 180 degrees.